Hello guys, we are back with our next lecture. In this lecture, let us go through the next question. Okay, so this question belongs to Gate CSC 2011 guys. Okay, so the question is an undirected graph G of V comma E contains N greater than 2. Okay, so they have clearly told that N value should be greater than 2. Okay, and nodes names from V1 to Vn. Okay, so two nodes Vi, Vj are connected if the distance between them is less than 0 or sorry is greater than 0 or less than or equal to 2 okay each edge v of i comma j is assigned a weight i plus j okay so an small graph with n vertices n equal to 4 is shown below so they gave an example for us below okay so what will be the cost of minimum spanning tree for the given n nodes okay so for our easy understanding they gave a small example guys right yes so for our easy understanding instead of solving on n4 let us solve on n3 what's wrong with it right so if we take n equal to 3, it is nothing but v1, uh, v2, v3, right? So the distance, if the distance is between 1, 0, sorry, it is 1 or 2, you can add the list, right? So the distance between these two will be 1, distance between these two will be 2, distance between these two will be 1. So all, uh, it's a complete graph, okay? Yes. So what will be the cost? It is i plus j. So this cost will be 3. What will be this cost? This cost will be 4. What will be this cost? This cost will be 5. So if I write the minimum or if I draw the minimum spanning tree, it will look in this way, right? To be 3. So here 4 plus 3 that is equals to 7. So if I substitute n equal to 7 I should get a, sorry n equal to 3 I should get 7 as the result okay. So let us take first option first. So option A says that it is a 1 by 12 into 11 into n square that is a 3 square is a 9 minus a 5 into n is a 5 into 3 which is a 15 right yes. So let us solve it. So it is a nothing but 11 into 9 so I think it's visible right at least okay minus so let us write equal to first after that minus the value 15 okay divided by 12 okay so the answer is 7 so option a could be correct similarly moving on to option b it is a nothing but n square that is a 9 minus 3 plus 1 so this answer is also 7 nice coming on to option c which is a 6 into 3 minus 11 Okay, 6 to 3 is our 18, 18 minus 11 will be 3, sorry 7, right, yes. So option C is also correct, coming on to option D, so option D 2 into 3 plus 1, so that is nothing but 6 plus 1, that is also 7, okay. So now options are created in such a way that the answer is absolutely matching guys, okay. So now I am interested in this question, so let us take V4, I think shall we try on V4 guys or shall I directly, shall we directly go for V5, what do you say? So let us try it v5, v4, what is there that, right? So what's wrong with that? So we will take this edge, okay, so the cost is 3. Then you will take the next minimum value. You cannot take this value because it will form a loop. So you will take this value, right? It is nothing but 4, 3 and 6. So with the total cost is 13. So if uh, n equal to 4, the cost is 13, right? Yes. So let us uh, substitute. So let us come in the reverse order, guys. I think uh, first D option will be wrong. So 2 into n, that is uh, 8 plus 1 is equals to 9, right? It is not 13. So option D is wrong. Similarly, moving on to option C, that is a 6 into 4 minus 11. That is 24 minus 11. So still it is matching 13. Okay, so still C is, C is in race. Similarly, moving on to N square, that is a 16 minus, okay, 4 plus 1. Okay, so again, this is also 13. Okay, B is also in the race. Moving on to option 1, that is a 12 into, 40, uh, into 11 into 16 minus 5 into 4 that is 20 right yes so let me solve it in calc so 11 into 16 is equal to 176 minus 20 is equal to 156 divided by 12 this is also 13 okay so still 1 2 and 3 3 options are still in the race guys so now let us take 5 value 5 values so few of students have already taken like more values and they have solved the answer right i'm sure about it right yes so anyway i'll be solving from basics guys because in some exam in some questions in this values only like at 3 and 4 only you will get answers so that is the reason why i always start from basic values right 1 2 3 4 sorry my bad i forgot okay my bad so let me write at the bottom v1 v2 v3 v4 okay so let me write v5 here okay yes so here we are having here we will be having here we will be having here we will be having similarly okay similarly you will have for these two because the distance is two similarly for this so for these two you will not have okay yes so the cost will be three five four six seven the cost will be eight 
9 right yes so if you are drawing minimum spanning tree you will select this 3 you will select this 4 you will select this 9, 6 you will select this 8 so the cost will be 4 plus 3 plus 4 that is a 7 7 plus 6 that is a 13 13 plus 8 the cost will be 21 okay yes so now you got the cost right the cost value that is a 21 so now let us substitute in option a b and c so we are left out with three options right yes so let us start so let us start from option c again okay so we need to substitute n equal to 5 and we should get the cost as a 21 right or 21 or 23 just let me give, give me a second i'll cross checking it it is 21 right yes okay so let us substitute in c so 6 into 5 minus 11 okay so now i think now it's going to be wrong so 6 into 5 is 30 minus 11 so that is nothing but 19 right yes so option c is wrong with this answer okay so now moving on to option b that is a n square so 25 minus 5 plus 1 so now he is still b is in race guys okay similarly now coming on to a it is a nothing but 1 by 12 into 11 into 25 minus 25 right yes so let us calculate it so it is nothing but 11 into 25 minus 25 divided by 12 so the answer okay so this answer is in decimals that is 20.833 okay so now with this conclusion you can say b is the correct answer so few students who have luckily taken n equal to 5 initially i thought of taking but i thought that it is easy if i start from basics so if a student who have taken n equal to 5 in the initial cases have directly ended up at this answer right so the equation will be n square minus n plus 1 guys for this particular question got it yes it's a quite easy question got it yes so i hope everyone got some basic idea on this so in the next lecture let us continue with the next question thank you thanks for watching like share and subscribe for more awesome videos like this thank you